D D D D DJ DJ It's DJ Double here and today finally Trust me <laughs> Finally Trust me. in the building As it air Wolf from Stowe's finest Come on Big Tobes in the place. Yes, man, we there. Welcome, bro. That's Welcome good, to the show. Yeah, man. Love. It's uh, yeah, it's been a long-awaited interview. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I won't shoot you down about I feel it. It's bad. Cool. Yeah, don't don't call, cool. don't call me. Don't call me. Don't call me. <laughs> let's start with a twit. <coughs> let's start with a Twitter quote today. Yo. Whenever you want to give up, always remember why you started. The grind yeah. don't stop. Yeah, word. That word, was Big Tobes said that this morning. Yeah, man. Why did you start? Why did I start, yeah. man? The maddest thing is like. When I started, as in, I started for for just fun. But when I actually started in terms of like, I want to be a rapper, like I want to make it. Mm-hmm. <coughs> I was just seen as like, that was kind of, at the time it was like, that was the only kind of way I felt to do something that I love doing, that I'm not going to like, like, okay, boy, I went to, I went to uni, yeah? I studied animation. I didn't want to be an animator. Okay. I used to play basketball. I wanted to be a bowler, but that didn't go well. Right. So it's like music was the only thing that I kind of loved. That I thought, you know what, yeah, I can actually like look after my family with this. Like I can actually look after my friends with this. I can actually make a living out of this, innit? And I thought, you know what, that's when I said, you know, what, I'm gonna try and make this my career. And then yeah, that's kind of like why I really thought, you know, what, yeah, let me try and take this thing really, really serious and, mm. and push it properly, innit? So you just gotta remember those things, like, like when I'm when I'm feeling when I'm feeling like oh, it's long, man. <laughs> I gotta remember the aim, like the goal is to like make it, like not just to just get a bit of fame and then just fall back, like do you know what I'm trying to say. So yeah, yeah, get that house money in. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying to do that, man. Trying exactly. To do that. Um, 2016 was a very good year for you, I feel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think a month went past where your <coughs> name wasn't out there for, for musical sound, yeah. reasons. Like yeah. it, it was good, man. It was a good mm. year for you. Um, but you've been doing this for a while. Yeah. So yeah, for yeah, some yeah. people, obviously, that they're new to you. Mm. As an artist, they might think you just popped up yeah. early 2016. Uh, uh, uh. But I mean, I'm, I I got like, what was it, East Side thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah early yeah. 2015. 15, Real yeah. is all I know. 2015. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? These yeah, songs yeah, that yeah. were were kind of out there. Uh. And even when I, I had Heavy Trackers on the show not too long ago. Okay. And yeah. they even confirmed, yeah, yeah, Tobes has been Damn in the studio it. for uh, years. Yes. They actually said years yeah, working yeah, with yeah, them guys. Yeah, yeah. So like, when did you actually start taking this thing seriously? Probably in two thousand and fourteen, but the, the yeah probably two thousand and fourteen, probably when I dropped a video called Winning. I think that was the kind of like whoa, like after after before I was dropped before I dropped Winning, I had a lot of videos. I had, I had a few mixtapes, but it wasn't, it wasn't like it's like say like, like it wasn't over there yet. It was just like within like say my ends knew about it, like my people knew about it, but yeah. I didn't even realize there was such a big audience uh-huh. out there because I was just happy in the yeah. Localized. Ten people said it's cool, yeah, yeah, I'm <laughs> doing good, like. Yeah. But then when I dropped winning, it's like raw, so like raw. This much people could think now. Now hundred people think I'm good. Raw is this much? Do you know what I'm trying to say? And then that's when I think after I dropped winning, that's when Jamal Edwards told me for a warm up. But like I've been trying to get a warm up session for like. 2012, like, like mm. as in, like, I seen it on thing. Yeah, that looks like it's the thing for the for the rappers, innit? <laughs> and then he hollered, and then Graham Daly hollered for a rating, and it's like these things were happening, and that's when I thought, raw, okay, this music thing's getting kind of kind of popping now, innit? And then obviously, you know my style in 2000, and I dropped that in December, I think. Yes, yeah, so it's December. late 2015. Then that opened my eyes, like raw. So it's even more like, you know, what I'm trying to say, like raw, nice bookings now. Yeah, now I'm getting yeah, shows yeah. now, so right now nah, this is my job, like, and, like <laughs> That's this, is, it. this is my job now, like this is me now. I can't go back. So it's like there's just been stages of like seriousness, and then getting more serious, and then getting more serious, and then this is me now. Like now I'm a rapper, like, but like before two fa- like even even 2014 to 2015, it was like I'm good at rapping, innit? Mm-hmm. I'm not, I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a rapper, but. I didn't think I was going to be a rap star. Like, well, I didn't think I'm, even yeah, still, I'm yeah. still grinding now, but like, I didn't think that was the path. Like, I just thought I'm good at this. Whatever happens, happens, innit? But now I can't go back. I can't like, yeah. just decide. I don't want to, I want to quit. can be. Yeah, I can't, I can't quit and be like, I want to work in Tesco now. Like, and no one's going to know I'm big toes anymore. Like, I'm a new, I can't do that. I have to. Yeah, yeah, I have yeah. To, I can't go back now. Do you no, know what I, I mean? So I, I think now, right now is like, this is really serious. Like, this is really, really serious now. Yeah, I think the first song that really made me pay attention to you was Real Is All I Know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really when liked I, the record the first that? first time I heard it. So I I got onto that, like, I think early 2015. Okay. I don't know when you made it or when it first came out, but yeah. that's when I got onto when it. That's when I done it still. I feel it was around that time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we've not really had anything f- like that from you since, because that's a very, like, melodic song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot yeah, of harmonies yeah, yeah, in yeah, there yeah. and stuff, but yeah. 
you're obviously now more into the rap. Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, with yeah. with that song, are you comfortable singing? Bro, you see my EP, yeah. <laughs> I'm basically singing on like every hook. Oh, okay. Well, melody, all the say melodies on every hook, like on right. every tune, and it's like there's like eight tunes. So like I've kind of broken out because re- when I done real like real is what I know, yeah. I got a big on my boy Joby, yeah. He's a producer. Yeah, shouts to Joby. See, see, when I go to Joby's yard, at the time I used to go to his yard. He had a studio in his yard. And it's like, he kind of got me out of that comfort zone of rapping into like trying out melodies because he had a little auto tune there. That's how it started. It's auto right. tune. Okay. I'll be on there like having fun. And it's like, Joby's like, yeah, you know, you, you got you got a decent tone, you know. You should. So from then I started just getting, because cause cause this is his house and he's my boy. I can I can experiment, you know what I'm trying yeah, to say? Yeah, yeah, of course, your comfort zone. And, and then it's like, that's when I started doing that. But even that, like, really is, like, really is all I know is nothing compared to like, the melodies and the and the and the, the the vocal talent that I've got now kind of thing. I've improved. I've just been practicing, 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 and it's just coming out, man. But yeah, I'm 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 comfortable doing the the, the vocal singing. I'm comfortable doing that now, man. That's how it's about more catchy, man. outside the studio because, like you said, you're getting a lot of shows now. I mean, yeah. there's there's a lot of times I'm seeing flyers and most of them have your name on there. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So are you doing these performances and you are you comfortable singing live in the club? The, the singing thing live is a bit harder. Because, because I made tunes like because when I was getting booked, I was getting booked on not tunes that I have to sing on. Do you know Things what I mean? Like, like you know my you style, you know my style, yeah, yeah. rapping my circle or see like them kind of tunes. I've not had to sing like or only when Controller dropped. Uh huh. Now I got to drop some vocals. <laughs> yeah. like, you get me? That's when I started. In it. First I was a bit rusty, but then the more you do it and the more you you understand how you sound on the mic and and what kind of tone to use, the more I'm still trying to learn. I'm still trying to learn how to sing live because it's like. When you're in a studio to when you're on a mic, it sounds so different. Yeah, yeah. It's like, bro, I sound wavy in a studio, but when I go on a mic, it's like, it's, it's like, it don't sound the same. So you got to learn, you got to understand your sound and understand what's work, what works and stuff. So I'm still trying to get that singing live. Yeah. Even like, down to tight. stuff like breathing. <clears throat> yeah. When you're in the studio, you're in the booth, stood still. Yeah. But when you're on the stage, it's, you're excited. You're you've excited. got the adrenaline. You're moving you know around the stage. It's, it's, it's really that, different. That. It's really and different. It takes a lot of practice. The breathing practice is different, man. Yeah, Definitely. yeah, 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 yeah. So, so when you say you're learning this, like, have you got someone coaching you, or no, are you no, just kind of? I actually, actually want to do um, lessons, but I'm just, I'm just kind of learning by myself and just through shows, through trying, and through understanding. Okay, that was too loud. Or oh, I need to breathe like this when I'm doing it. Right. That's how I'm kind of just teaching myself. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what I'm trying to say? But you want to get a coach, yeah? I want to get a coach now, yeah, man. So good why, shout, why not? I'm trying to just. Hitting it from every angle, that. Like. So with with Joby, is that the first studio that no, you had no, experience no, no. in? The first ever studio was probably my boy jamming, but I was like in, in secondary school. But but ah, uh, but I was I want to I want to say that serious. But when I was when I was like years like 2011, 10, I used to record at Heavy Tracker Studio. Right. Okay. That was in my ends in it. We're from the same ends in it. Yeah, yeah. Of course. Obviously, them are not older than that. But it's like a guy Teddy from Heavy mm-hmm. Trackers. He had a studio in his yard. So like we used to go there all day, paid my little ten pounds an hour in session, and I used to go there all the time, like every day, every day, every day, and then they moved to the studio. But that was like my first studio that I was using for a while. Then Joby one day was just like, "Yo, come to my yard. Man's got a setup in my, in my yard, and his setup was nice." So from then, I started with Joby because Joby sit like controller was mixed, engineered yeah, by yeah. Joni. Jo- <coughs> I know the levels, style. man. Like his yeah, stuff he's ba- putting out now is yeah, exactly. So, sick. So like from then, I just kind of started with Joby. I still go to trackers when I'm doing tracker stuff. Yeah. Um, but it's mainly Joby still. That's that's my guy, man. Yeah, good that's people to be around, man. Because yeah, everyone that you've mentioned there, they know their stuff and they are yeah, all yeah. heavy trackers and Joby are yeah. putting out very high quality music. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's really them, good. Um, so what was so? I guess you know my style was mm. kind of the turning point for you. Would you uh, say one hundred percent? The real breakthrough record. One hundred percent. It's like winning was the breakthrough on the just just the youtube scene as in like the link up tvs now now the link up tvs know about me on the like the platforms know about me now yeah yeah, yeah. but then you know my style was the <clears throat> was a breakthrough on the like to the fans to the fans like and shows and, first, and was it the like. first thing that got a million views yeah yeah how how excited were you like were you refreshing oh, every bro. day like how many now how many now how many now because it's mad like it's mad isn't it is 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 that raw man's got a million views but i'm i'm, I'm still one of them guys that's like once i get it, i'm like shit like I need my other things to hit media now. Like I need to get, yeah, yeah, to, you yeah. know what I'm trying to say? Like I'm always like, nah, man, like I need to think like, I'm never, ga- I'm never really gassed like that. Innit? I'm just like, yeah, that's sick. But nah, man, this all storms you get one million in a day. Like you get yeah, me? Like yeah, I need yeah. to, I need to go harder. Like you know what I'm trying to say, <laughs> that's me in it. So <coughs> with you, my, you know, my style, there was a situation, you had a very controversial marketing scheme yeah, around that. Yeah, that so it's to do mad. with the, the stabbing that happened yeah, in the, yeah, in the yeah, tube yeah, station yeah. and the video. Yeah. And there was a bit of backlash because obviously 
as soon as these things happen, everyone, uh, including press and that, they're yeah, all on you on Twitter. Yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. we want to interview what happened. Yeah, da, da, da. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing musical. Yeah, they just, just want to know mm, eyewitness perspectives mm. and that. And then one of the things you did, you tweeted a link, yeah. obviously, to the video. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then suddenly they're like, ah, oh, Wolf from Stowe rapper. <laughs> da, 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 da. And there was a huge backlash in, in middle class England. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going mad bad, about you. Like, bad. D- uh, it's crazy because you know the whole situation there. Like People still think to this day that I recorded it. Even right. you, might, I didn't record it. <laughs> I've got a group chat with my bedrooms in it. Right. And one of, my, one of my boys must have sent the videos in the chat. So I've seen it. I've not really seen what's really going on. I'm seeing Rod. There's a man that's in Leightonstone Station. There's right. a stabbing. I've seen the blood and the thing. So that's and your I'm, local area though, right? That's no, I'm from Walthamstow. Leightonstone's, it's not It's not my area, but it's just, it's not far Down from me. It's right. not far from me, innit? Um, so I'm like, Rod, but I'm, I'm seeing the video. I'm seeing Feds trying to taser one guy. So I'm thinking, Rod, like, what's this? a mad thing, innit? So yeah. I posted on my Twitter, like, part one, part two. I, I didn't think that I was I was like the first person to post this. I thought like right. this must right, whatever it's latest on it, it's local, like whatever. Let me post it in it. Post it, post it. And then everyone was like retweeting and did it. I was like, raw, raw, like did it, did it. I was, like, my, 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 my third one was obviously the video in it. At this time, my thought was like I wasn't thinking about how deep the actual situation was. Yeah, like, yeah. That, See, that, I that thought you that's... were there. I thought it was no, you. No, that no, no. So I'm just posting the video that someone's but, posted. Right, it, so okay. I'm just like like kind of that kind of thing in it yeah, yeah, and yeah. i posted the third one and it was off the video because obviously i'm getting barry tweets everyone's on my page so i'm like okay yeah so yeah, you know yeah. what check my video while you're, while you're at it kind of thing in it <laughs> so i've done that now and it's like all these presenters all these news reporters are, are hitting me up tweeting me but i'm thinking are these fake yeah, things yeah, yeah. i've never had like the son actually tweeting me yeah, yeah, yeah and i wasn't there i'm thinking i'm sure the person who done it would have because how did my guy get the video you know what i'm trying to say something it must yeah. be out there already like and then so i'm making but they're like oh like they want to do i'm like raw hundred bags on this. I'm not I'm probably just taking it as a banner like raw come this ain't this ain't, this ain't real like this ain't really happening to me right now. So I'm saying these things are just banner in it so it's like obviously it was a real deal in it like yeah, you know yeah, to yeah. Say? and it just all kind of came at me like the sun came to my house. How did they find out where you live? I have no idea bro. They, they, they came to my house and they rung me and they rung me. There. Yeah and they rung me. I was like whoa wow. like and they left the card with my brother or something like I was like if he wants to speak I'm like what and I see my emails bear like can I get I'm thinking Wait, and then I see myself in the in the in the papers like yeah. I'm like blood. Is this shit? Is this sorry, is this real? Like is this real? Like but that thing was just whole like it was just it was just weird. Yeah, it was just weird. Like it, it didn't hit me. I was like raw. Like I didn't mean it. Like I didn't mean to like yeah, yeah, take yeah. the piss out of the situation. It was like I just had bare thing on my page and I thought raw. Might as well tweet my link to my video in it. Yeah, and then yeah. when they was hitting me up, I was like, because I don't like the press. Like them kind of because you see what they done to me. They said, "Oh, Wolf, I'm still rapper. Yeah, exactly. Wanna be rapper? Just it around, so I've yeah. never liked them in it. So when they're asking me for interview, I'm kind of like taking the piss at them because like you don't take the piss out of us in it kind of thing in it. Yeah. And it's like obviously they didn't like that in it. So that's why I think that's why they made the article like that or whatever. And yeah. And it was just one of them ones. They just it, need to write about something. Yeah. They need. So to, they, need it, a, they need to write about something. Safe to assume you didn't get the hundred grand. No, of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course. They were trying to. They were trying to. They were trying to like hit me up and that. But obviously it's not my video in it, so I got nothing to say. So yeah. when I said hundred grand, I wasn't trying to get hundred grand really. Do you like. re- do you regret posting it that way or is it like? No, because that bus man at the same time. Because after that. Bear people, like even the views for you know my style went up. Yeah, yeah, of there course. Was, I got bear like you see, see when it happened, yeah, the followers blood like when I was getting I'm t- I'm talking about like every other like minute I'm getting like a hundred followers. Yeah, yeah, like it's crazy. Like the next morning, like I've got like a whole couple thousand more followers. Like even though I'm getting backlash negative, people are still clocking right. He's actually he's, the, the tune's good. Actually like looking the music. Yeah, 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 like the tune's actually good. They can hate obviously because obviously when I went to my comments and you know my you know my style, there was bare people chatting rubbish like ah oh, yeah you sent us here but. I know a lot of people was feeding the tune, so listen to the song, at yeah. the same time, and then obviously, <coughs> I ended up like telling the people what happened, the situation, and explaining myself, and then I done a freestyle as well. Yeah, and the freestyle banged, and then I got a lot of people on my side again, That's kind it. of thing in it, and then now it's like I've got all these thousand followers, and they just seen a sick freestyle now explaining it, and they think I'm good, so now I'm I'm good. <laughs> Do you know what I'm trying to, to win, say? yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. The the remixes. Uh, there was remixes, yeah, which yeah, was yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Obviously, Steph London was there, Miss Banks, yeah, Danae, like Abilene, Banks. Like Western. Yeah. But how did you choose who went on the remixes? Um, so the first remix, I've done a few. I think the first one was with T.E. T.E. is my bedroom. Mm, yeah, yeah, shout out so to T.E. So he went man. to jump on it. I sent it to Six, done his thing. Cool. Um, then there was Young Tribes and Skeng. Mm-hmm. Young Tribes, I know. I talked to Young Tribes. He phoned me like, yo, let me jump on this. Cool, send him a thing. And then with Steph London and Miss Banks, I personally chose, I was like, you know what, yeah, I want to do a female remix. 
And I thought, who are the three baddest t- girls? I was about to say ting, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> who are the, <laughs> who are the baddest, who are the baddest female rappers? I, I had a few in mind. I'd, I'd shy steal. I was thinking like, who were the best in it? And then it came down to like Miss Banks. Miss Banks was like, oh, she can holler at Steph. Yeah, I think yeah. it was meant to be Miss Banks, Steph and Paigey. I don't know what happened, but Miss Banks was like, she can holler at Steph. I like, yeah, shout Steph for me, innit? She shout at Steph, Steph's feeling it. They done their verses, all sick. That's when we done that video. And then with the um, Western, Avelino and Deneo, <coughs> I shouted, I shouted, I know Avelino as well, that's my boy. Okay, so yeah. So I patterned Avelino already. Western, I shouted, um, I know Morgan Keys. Okay, so I shouted yeah. Morgan Keys, like, yo, did did, did He's like, yeah, we'll chat to, we'll chat to Louis and, and um, Akel. Mm-hmm. And they was on it. And then it was like, oh, I think Deneo must have said a tweet about the tune sick. And then I think Morgan was ma- managing Deneo. So, yeah, yeah. so Morgan got to Deneo for me kind of thing. And then I got Deneo on it. And then that that just worked so well because they all know each other as well. Yeah, yeah. And then that happened kind of thing, yeah. Once you're in, you're in. Once you're in, you're in, man. But so, yeah, yeah, sick, man. Who do you reckon did the best verse out of oh, all the remixes? That's a hard one, man. I think Avelino's my favourite verse, man, not all of them. But then Steph London killed us. Like, everyone went in, but probably Avelino and Steph London still. Mm. Avelino, yeah. so underrated, bro. That's like, my guy. Pains He's so me, bro. underrated. Avelino, so like... lyrical, like. He's amazing. <laughs> Actually amazing, that. Like. Um, what's the studio session with Deneo like? Yeah, Deneo, Deneo, Deneo's wavy, man. Deneo's like... He can actually sing, bro. Like, yeah. He can actually sing, like, and he's he's got mad ideas, and he's he's very excited, man. He's proper like bouncy, like he's proper excited, like he'll gas me up. That's 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 the yeah. nail. But then the nail will say that I gas him up as well, yeah. kind of thing. But that's the nail, isn't it? He's yeah. sick, and because because obviously when I was younger, I was on the train listening to his tunes, about to go to Raven when I was just turning eighteen and stuff like. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. The nail was like. I've always looked up to him as as a legend. So to get him on a tune, even being in, even being in the studio with him, it's like, bro, I'm here with the nail blood. Like, yeah, they get me. And, and it he, feels like he's not just that, not just that, but it feels like he's a fan of yours. Yeah, you know yeah, that's he mad. likes the music you do it's rather weird. than just working. Yeah, like. it's weird. when he hits me up, like, yo, toes, bro. This is it's weird. It's like, bro, like, do you know who you who you was to man? Yeah, like, yeah, but, yeah. But yeah, man, it's good, man. We got the nail, man. All day, bro. Trust he's me, yeah, he's sick. Man, uh, you teamed up with Blitz. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did yeah, a yeah. very, very, very good project there. Yeah, yeah. Case closed. So you and Blitz from the same area? Yeah, yeah. So you grew up stuff. together? You think, I've known Blitz for like six, seven years. Right, okay. So you've known so him long enough, long enough. Musically, yeah. you've grown yeah, up together. Yeah, yeah, musically, right. yeah, musically, you've grown up together, yeah. Whose who's idea was it to do the joint project? Um, I mean, me and Blitz had a had a project pending for time. Because like, we've been making tunes from so long, from 2010, 2011. Yeah. We've always been saying we need a project together kind of thing, innit? We never got to it, I don't know why. Because obviously we're both solo artists at the same time, so we have mm-hmm. our own things going on. And then with Heavy Jack is there as well. They, I think, was it them that kind of suggested you lot do a... I think me and Blitz was doing a back-to-back things on Twitter, the videos and that, which was getting a lot of love. And then Heavy Chackles kind of came to us like, yo, they want to do an EP with us, innit? And they make all the beats. And obviously, that's normal for us. That's like, cool, yeah, let's do it kind of thing. And yeah, that's, how, yeah, that's yeah. how it came about, really, yeah. I think The Move is probably my favourite track off is, of, of yeah, that project. I love yeah. storytelling rap, yeah, man. Like, yeah, I was just yeah, having yeah. this conversation earlier with someone like... Yeah. Yeah, I absolutely love it, like... When it comes to building those kind of songs, how do you sit down and write that stuff? That's a lot. See me and Blitz, see the thing about me and Blitz, yeah, there's something that we have that is just it's natural and it's like like before the movie was did you did you see the back to back freestyles we used to do like on Twitter? I don't think I saw all of them. We had I saw, I saw some of them, yeah. We've done we done a few and like even that's like we just I don't know, I can't answer that, but we just it's so easy for us, like I can't even explain, like it's just I think because he knows my style, I know his style. We, we both rap kind of similar, our, our vision's kind of similar. It's like, so when we do, like, when we done a move, it's like, boom, okay, this is the idea. Our idea, we're going to rub this shoot, we're going to take him, da da da. So I'll be like, I'll do a line. And he'll literally reply to me, but I'll just put rhymes in there. Then I'll reply back to him. Right. But we're writing it down at the same time, innit? Yeah. And it's like, well, I'm at, and then I'm at my, my turn is a four bar. So I'll write this. We're going to take him there, take him back there. Then after going to da 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 Then he's like, okay, boom. But da da You know what? And we're just yeah, like, yeah, we're yeah. just making up the story as we go. But we're rhyming it as well. But it's, it's not that hard to, for us, it's not hard to rhyme, innit? Yeah. And that's how the move came about, literally. And then obviously we just recorded it in the studio. He done his parts. I filled in the gaps of the, my parts. And yeah, yeah, yeah. that's how it came The video about. is good as well, man. Yeah, like, big up, big up. Where's, um, yeah, who, yeah, who made Monix, the video? Monix, Jay Monix, Jay Monix. Big up Monix, man. Is there going to be a part two? There needs to be, bro. You can't leave us. You can't leave us like this. Like <laughs> right, right now, it's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit political, like behind the scenes, isn't it? So right, um, haven't really been working with Blitz too tough, but is that where the politics are between you and Blitz? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We right, haven't okay. really been with each other. You know what I'm saying, but you never know, man. You never know, man. Heavy trackers. Teddy came to us with an idea, which, which is gonna blow everyone's mind. Yeah, but recently, yeah, okay, that might work, and I'll be crazy. 
So we'll have to just wait and see, man. Wait and see, right. wait and see, wait and see. Well, I hope so, bro, because I'm yeah, waiting. Man. I'm waiting for that part two, man. So yeah, hopefully you, you guys crazy. can put your differences aside. Yeah. Um, another good duo, obviously, you and Cadet. Big up Cadet, man. Banging My right bro. now, like <laughs> sick. And Cadet, from man. the moment when I saw, um, obviously Corn Anthem started as that little viral video of you yeah, sat yeah, in the yeah. car, yeah, yeah, yeah doing yeah, that, yeah, and yeah, that yeah, made yeah. that you broke the internet with yeah, that, bro. That like, was not expecting that. At <laughs> Ooh, bro, like, was not expecting that at all. Was that writing that with with Cadet? Was it a similar process? Do you know I actually you... know the answer to this because Cadet was in not too long ago. But yeah. for everyone that watching this that <laughs> hasn't seen the Cadet interview, <laughs> you can answer the question. Yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty. It was pretty easy, man. Like, see what is here. <coughs> when it comes to this like Twitter online video freestyle thing, you like, got it on lock, bro. Like you know, me and Blitz got on lock, and Cadet got like he's always the one that he will drop a video. He will get yeah. married. We'll drop a video, we get married to so like he's the guy like as well. And we're the guys that kind of thing. So when I linked up, it's like the guys just doing it together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't I didn't know if it was gonna work because I've not done a back to back with anyone else apart from Blitz. So I didn't know if it was gonna work. But his character is very similar to mine, his energy and enthusiasm. Yeah. And like he's very a lot like me kind of thing, it? so it just worked out. And how that how that started, we wanted to do the devs, he what 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 we what 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 yeah. he, what 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 where. That remix, yeah. <laughs> I love how you had to actually say <laughs> yeah, the bars to get right. Yeah, I have and to do the same thing. <laughs> yeah, Cadet was actually like, yo, let's do like a Twitter video first just to gas them before we drop it. This was like the day or the day after I cut off my bed, innit? Mm. Yeah. So I've linked Cadet after a radio sound in, in Shoreditch, Brick Lane. And we've gone there like, and he's just like, right, yeah, I might just cut your bed. Like, can we just diss each other? Like, we're just, we're just bantering, innit? Yeah. Kind of thing, innit? It was sending me chord. I was just looking at him like, what can I call you about? Like, first, but he's like, <laughs> headline. And it, do you know what I'm saying? We're just friendly, innit? We're just giving us giving each other a call. And like, and like, and like, like how I did with Blitz, we'll just write down the bars. You'll send yours. And then, boom, I'll write, okay, cool. Do, 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 do. I'll just rhyme with his pattern. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But say something about him. And then that's how that came about. And I remember the moment we were so, we so excited to even post on Twitter, like, bro, this is it. Like, we don't know where it's, where it's going to do. Like, I thought it was going to get like a normal. Buzz, maybe yeah, a thousand yeah, yeah. retweets. Then we dropped the who. I thought the who, what, what, where remix was the big thing, not yeah, the yeah. the freestyle. I thought this freestyle was gonna lead up to this sick remix that we're gonna do, but it ended up being that to be the main thing. Yeah, yeah. And that's how it came about, man. Yeah, it's yeah. it's sick, bro. Did with that record, did you feel right in it? Like, was there a point where you're like, hang on, like, I don't want to get too personal, like. Yeah, obviously you can't get you can't get too personal. It has to be something that we can both laugh, laugh about. Just and, if, the bands. and when the fans are like, eh, look at we don't care kind of thing, yeah, innit? Yeah, you know what yeah, I'm trying yeah. to say? Like, so it had to be, it couldn't be like personal, like raw. Mums best off friend. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no mums, <laughs> no mums, no sisters, no family members. Yeah. Just stuff on, 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 each, on each other that we don't care minutes. about. Yeah, yeah, that's it, man. That's it, man. That's yes. It. What's the main project with you and Cadet? I know you must have, you, you're cooking something, surely. Yeah, we're, we're like, cool, after we're... <laughs> like, you can't yeah, we, not we have de- a Yeah, we definitely want to do like an EP. Do you know what I'm going to say? EP of just like, different kind of songs and just obviously corn we were thinking about corn part two as well okay yeah we've already got the beat for that and all that, and all that. oh so, so you're yeah. not just thinking about it yeah like, we're, we're gonna do we're gonna already, do that eventually yeah, yeah. the only thing we would have done it already just that i've got so much other solo things going on right now like i've got my ep i'm, I'm trying to drop mm-hmm. but i couldn't do too much at once but like this year probably summer definitely gonna try to drop something sick yeah yeah, yeah just in time definitely. for those festivals and yeah, stuff man, which yeah, we can man. talk about in a moment yeah who would be your ultimate collaboration like dead or alive if you could have Anyone on probably, the record? Probably Chris Brown, you know. Chris Brown. Definitely, mm. I think definitely Chris Brown. Actually, yeah. I like him. He's not. He's not the most popular guy mm. at the moment. Mm. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> his situation is mad. But when I look at his, when I look at his art, yeah, he's incredible, man. And he's yeah. just such a sick performer. Like you just, he's so sick, bro. Like you, uh, definitely Chris Brown. Good shout. That's yeah, a good shout. Good so you mentioned a couple of times a new EP that's on the way. Yeah. So let's talk about it. I don't really know much about the new EP. Usually yeah. when I start interviews, like I'm fully yeah, loaded. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know everything really, about I everything. I haven't really spoke about it to you. Stuff. It's just something I've been working on behind the scenes kind of thing. Yeah. So but it's calling me part of this new EP because that's that's the single we're running with at the moment. It was, it was originally song. going to be because yeah. it's out and I've done a video and like the EP was wrapped up, got all the tunes and that was one of the tunes. Mm-hmm. But the other day I wrote a banger, yeah? <laughs> and I'm thinking I might just replace it with calling me since calling me out there anyway. Right, okay. And then... Yeah, just replace it with that. So tune, it's gonna it? be all new music, all the all, stuff from the EP. New, nothing new music, is out yeah, yet. Yeah, all new music, all new music. Okay, crazy. So talk to me about it. Like, oh, how many oh, tracks? Man. There's eight tracks. Producers. Producers got Joel B on there. Got Lash. You made you know my style. I got a girl called Karma Cruz. Um, I've got um, Penthouse. Um, a guy called JC Beats. Mm. And. That's it still, I think that's it. I think there's one other producer, but I can't get the name. I need to get the name. But yeah, different producers, weirdly. 
Yeah. What um do you have like so you said basically it's ready it's ready to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just needs to get mixed and mastered, that's it. Okay, so is there any release date like when are you thinking? Well, I got my headline show, April the fifth, and I said to my manager, I really want to get this EP out before the headline show. Okay. So God willing, everything goes well, then it'll be sometime in March, middle of March or something. Got to find you know the mean? Friday that works with yeah, the Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So Yeah, sick. What tell me one song that you're most excited about? It's so, so hard, like it's so hard. <laughs> my outro sick. My outro was meant to be my firing. I actually wrote written for a fire in the booth. Okay, that sound real deep about what's everything like things that's happened, that kind of stuff in it. Yeah, yeah, that's real deep. That's like my outro. That's gonna touch a lot of people. Then like, so that's a, are we talking about? That's like proper <laughs> lyricism on that. One, yeah, yeah, like right? I'm rapping like yeah, yeah. from the soul. Like I'm okay. not. It's not just about having fun. Like I'm actually rapping about real like life stuff. And and then I got tune. There's so much bangers on there, bro. Like I got. And I actually went to Cape Verde the other day and a few islands to shoot three other videos from the um, EP that are going to probably drop hopefully <coughs> bef- hopefully before and during the show period. I don't know, man. Bro, the, I'm excited. I'm, 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 <laughs> so I'm, there's, I'm, there's eight bro, songs like, on Yeah, I'm excited, excited about, all of them, right? bro, man. All of them, man. <laughs> so I'm, d- I'm doing something different. Like, all the tunes is going to be stuff that you've not heard Tobes like this before. Okay. Like, Ross, swear down Tobes is on that. Like, swear down right, Tobes right, is right. doing that. So that's why I'm excited for all of them. Cause the response is going to be like, Ross, is that what you're on? Like, is that Ross? You, you leveled up, like, do you know what I'm trying yeah, to say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's quite sick about you that you are very versatile yeah, yeah, as yeah. an artist. Like I say, I mean, the, uh, from Real Is All I Know, where, you, yeah. where you're singing to You Know My Style, where you're rapping, yeah. to things like Corn Anthem, which yeah. I say is grime. Yeah, yeah. Do you mean yeah, it's not grime. a rap record? That's yeah, a grime yeah, yeah. song. Yeah. So yes, yeah, and and controller. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. calling me, which are yeah. more like, I don't know what box to put them in. They're kind of like, they're like dancehall records. Almost yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, at the moment, yeah, they're that, that whole. That dance, that, yeah. That's the popular vibe yeah, at the yeah, moment. Yeah, 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 yeah. <coughs> so that's that's always a good thing about you. Mm. Um, another thing I've noticed about you, you're always supporting other artists. Yeah. Online, yeah. if you look through, apart from today, yeah, which again we'll talk about in a minute, but. Mm. Normally, you look through your timeline, mm. and out of ten tweets, six or seven of them might mm. be you retweeting other artists yeah, or yeah, picking yeah. up other artists on their work yeah, and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for you, like, why did you do that? Someone was saying that to me the other day. One of my boys was he was, he was in a bit. He was like, "Bro, how come you're always supporting these artists? But I, I never see these artists tweeting your stuff or did it." But for me, it's like, for one year, I think a lot of artists don't support other artists because a lot of artists are scared, man. Like, I'll be real with you, like, so a lot of artists are scared and they. Like, they don't want to share fans. But for me, it's like, if you've done a banger and I like the tune, I'm not a guy to, like, hide it. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't care if you're in the same league as me and we're in competition. We're supposed to be in competition. Like, I li- if I like it, I'm going to tweet it. Do you know what I'm saying? Well, if you tweet me something and I, I actually see it and I listen to it, I'm going to tweet it. Well, if, I, if I'm online and I see something and it's sick, I'm going to tweet it. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm going to say? I'm, I don't really think about, should I do it? Like, I've seen it. I've, I like it. I'm going to tweet it's it. It's dope I'm gonna, because it's like, that shows the confidence you have in yourself. Yeah, and I'm not, I'm really not scared. You're not threatened yeah, by not supporting threatened. someone else's stuff. Yeah. Like. It's not even a thing where I think because I'm better than you, I don't care. I just feel like I'm just doing me in it. If they like me, they like me. If they don't, like it's like I'm not, I'm not thinking about competition. I'm just thinking about doing me. Like that's doing me. I'm not thinking about what he's doing or what he's doing. Yeah. Like if I'm thinking, if I'm thinking about what someone else is doing, it's only like raw because I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna level up. You're, you're making me wanna go harder. It's not like ah, uh, mm, I don't want him to take my fight. I'm not like that, man. It's like. It's, yeah. a, it's, a, it's a it's a fun sport for me, man. Yeah, that's you know sick though. I wish more artists were like that. There's mm. a lot art. There's a lot that are like that. Yeah, of course, hundred percent. I just wish everyone was like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be dope. There was so there was an incident last year. Yeah. Where you kind of musically went quiet, a yeah. little bit quiet, and then I was looking obviously on your Snapchat. Yeah. And you had like a, basically you got shot and you got stabbed. Yeah, 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 yeah. What like what happened? Tell me about well, that situation. Well, all I can say for that is that is that bad people bad things happen to good people, man. Right. And it's just about how you bounce back. Yeah. Like a lot of people in my situation would have like said, you know what, yeah? Forget music, I'm doing road. Or they would have said, no, nah, they want to do music. Nah, it's too much for me. Like, But for me, that situation, the thing is, yeah, like I got shot in my back. The bullet's still in my back all now. Right. And it's like right next to my spine. So I'm so lucky. Like, so they you know couldn't take it they out. Couldn't they take couldn't it out operate out. Because they would have to move nerves. Right. And that could trigger things to this. But where it is right, right and the way it is, it's not in a, in a light, in, it's not even in a threatening place. It's right. It's in a, secure so place it's where there. it's just there in it and my face obviously my face could have been worse I'm still talking I can still spit kind of thing in it yeah, yeah. So I'm trying to say like my nerves is a bit a bit mad in it but all, all healing due time in it but it's like when I was in hospital it's like for when I was in hospital for a week and I come out yeah like it's like 
at the time I was angry that it happened and why it happened because it shouldn't have happened to me. Basically, what happened should never have happened to me. Right. You know, what I'm trying to say like, but it's like, I kind of just saw it as like, bro, like, but a lot of people that would have gone through that would not be still how you are right now. Yeah, yeah. And so I just see it as I'm a spiritual guy as well, and it so it's like. I just saw it as like a blessing that, bro, maybe maybe God was trying to tell me like, yo, you need to like cut yourself away from these kind of people. You need to like move more patterned or you need to understand that, bro, this is a harsh world. Not everyone loves you. Just because you, just because you got love for everyone doesn't mean everyone gives a, gives a crap about yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. So he kind of taught me so much things and I think like maybe, I don't want to say that maybe God, I don't want to say that God let it happen like because it shouldn't happen to anyone that don't deserve it, innit? But <coughs> the fact that I'm okay and I'm doing good, like I come out, Controller dropped after that, that yeah, done yeah. bits. Like so much good things have happened after that. It's like maybe God just, I don't, maybe I still got yet to learn on what, but it's like, I just see it as, do you know what? Yeah, bro, I'm blessed, man. Yeah. That's how I see it, man. I just feel like I'm blessed. Like, it shouldn't happen to me, but it happened to me. I'm okay. It could have been worse. I'm sure, I just see it as like, I'm, I'm sure God's got a big plan for me. Like, to let, to let, to allow me to have to go through that, there must be like some higher blessing that's going to come, come to me or some, Sun, you know what I'm trying to say? That's how I see it in it because I don't really have all the answers. I feel like it was something when it happened, it hmm. wasn't really publicized. So yeah. I feel I feel like for you, it wasn't a defining part. You know, some people there's been instances where this has happened, yeah, and that's been stuff that's either bust them or it's like you say, like, yeah, maybe yeah, they've, yeah. they've left music, but yeah, for you, it was what it kind of happened, kept it moving, yeah, it happened to you in mm. real life, not yeah. in music, life. Yeah, so yeah, I don't yeah, feel yeah. it's like. Oh, Big Tobes, who's that? You know, the guy that got the shot and yeah, stabbed. Yeah, like, yeah, it's the, yeah. you know, the guy who did Controller. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. was that act? Did you actively? Yeah, I actively keep didn't, the. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. Because some people, down. some people would have gone for him, like, yeah, look, man's been like, they would have like spoke about it. So, like, people feel like, yeah, I'm really in Street a field. Like, yeah, yeah. But for me, yeah. it's like, I've never been a rapper to try and be on some crud or to be on some gangster team. Yeah. So I'm just a wavy guy kind of thing, innit? So, that's not the kind of like. I'm not trying to be known as some rapper that's in beef and that's a rapper that's right, in right, this, right. innit? Because that's not the vibe, like. So, it's like, for me, it's like, like, I first did a snap on my snap, which was only meant to be on my snap here. I didn't realise people could still snap, did it? <laughs> yeah. On a snap, just let people know that I'm okay now because, like, people wanted to know what's good, innit? So, like, yeah, I'm okay, yeah. like, show them, bro, this happened, I'm okay. And then someone took it off my snap. That, that's, it wouldn't have even got out, like. No, people would have yeah. saw me, like, bro, you, why you got that slice on your face? Oh, yeah, man, just got shanked and shot the other day. But, um, so only because I put that snap out and then some, I think it was King MG or something on YouTube took the snap and then put it on YouTube. That's when a lot of more people started to know about it kind of thing, right, innit? Yeah, yeah. But if it was up to me, it would have been like, if you know, you know. If you don't, if you see me and you ask me, I'll be like, yeah, this happened. But I weren't trying to publicize it kind of thing, innit? But obviously, mm. it's part of my story, man. It's part of my journey, like. Yeah. I'm just happy that I'm inspiring people because people miss me all the day, like, bro, like, I'm inspired. Like, you went through that and you're still positive. You're still, like. Did it is so I'm just happy about that to be honest. It's a like, good thing, man. I'm just happy Definitely about that, man. is. What's the aspiration for you? Like, if you look ten years in the future, mm. where do you want to see big types? Trying to be an international superstar, man. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to have my own record label. Um, just have a, a nice stamp in the game, man. Mm. Have a sick merchandise. Like, yeah, man. Yeah, man. As I say with music, I'm still having fun. As serious, as serious as it is. I'm still having fun. I'm still just taking it how it comes. I don't know what to expect. Like That's the important thing. I don't thing. even know what to expect. I'm just taking it how it comes, just doing what I like. Yeah, it's important to have fun, man. When you can you can really tell with artists when they stop having fun. And yeah, just you can tell, innit? Yeah, you, you can, can tell. That's music. why some people do that. That's why I don't even want to get signed too tough because I've seen guys get signed. It's like, I don't know, man. It's like, I don't know. It just goes, I don't know, man. I don't know, I man. Think now I it think that's control. a goal. For an era that's gone, yeah, I don't think necessarily it's about being. Signed. Yeah, people ain't really then you get handcuffed and you have to follow instructions. Exactly, like I'm not really on that. I'm not really on that to be honest. Nah, man. I'm not, really on not that. at all. Um, so yeah, what's what's the next project? I saw. I remember you tweeted about a project with Distortion. Yeah. Well, what's happening with that? Because oh, I haven't heard man. it. Yet, yeah, yeah. No, I mean, it's the, we got Distortion. We got a tune there. Yeah, that I think is just gonna kill the festivals. Reading really truly, <laughs> it's not finished. Right. But we need to get in the booth and finish that tune. Because you sent that tweet a while back, bro. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, it's been like, a while. And then I just slept on it. I don't know. I just slept on it. But the tune's a banger, bro. Like, it's a proper festival. Like, it's th that's the kind of tune that can really cross me over. Like, mm -hmm. So hopefully I'll finish that tune. And then I don't know what the plans will be. I don't know what Distortion... I'm sure Distortion's got his connects or whatever. But, like, I don't know what we're going to do with the tune. But it's a banger still. You need like to hurry up, bro. I uh, know, I know, Festival no. season's fast approaching. Yeah, I know, yeah, Which yeah, brings yeah. us to today's yeah, announcement. Yeah, 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 yeah. I woke up and I opened Twitter. It wasn't mm. the first thing I did. I just put that there. But <laughs> I opened Twitter. When I opened Twitter, mm. all I could see was your name and yeah. you retweeting. And I'm like, what's happened? Like, mm -hmm. 
and it's, you've been announced for wireless. Yeah, so man. congrats, bro. Oh, blessed, man. I'm blessed, man. So talk to me. That's obviously kicked yeah, off your day oh, the right way. Bro, like, it's all mad because like I've had freestyles where I'm like, 2017, they better book me up in wireless. Did you know that I'm going so, hard? Like, someone was listening. So, 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 no, but I haven't even put it out. It's just stuff that I writ. Oh, right. Okay. So yeah, now yeah. i got to just throw these bars like now I've got because I'm here, innit? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. No, it's just it's sick, man. It's like, you know when you've been working so hard yeah, and you're finally getting rewarded. So it's like, I feel like, I deserve this anyway. Yeah. But it's just it's just it's just a blessing, man, because like I'm looking at the lineup. There's a lot of UK artists, but it's like there's only a few UK artists. Like you know what I mean? Like of my colour bar kind of thing. So it's like it's just it's just mad, man. It's mad, but I'm just I'm just thankful, man, to be there, man. Yeah. I'm just thinking about giving a sick performance now. That's what I'm thinking about now. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. a lot of pressure. That's that's thousands of people, isn't it? I think you know I, I mean? they've got cadets. So you're on a Saturday. Cadets on the Sunday, which is good. It's, it is perfect, and I think perfect. the organizers are probably planned on oh, yeah, way as well. perfect because you know I'm going to be there on Saturday. You know exactly. he's going to be there on Saturday. The cadets coming on Saturday. So, yeah, that's two, You're going to be that, there that's Sunday. Two, that's night. two. That's two. That's two days for me, man. Yes. So that's sick. sick. That's sick. That's sick. That is heavy, man. Is there any other shows that you need to announce? We've got the headline show coming. We've got the headline what is, what is show. Fourth of April. Fifth of April. Fifth of April. Fifth of April. That's at like London XOY, yo. Um, the ticket sales haven't gone out yet, but it will be soon. Mm. Um, I should be on some more festivals, hopefully, and. It's gonna, should, it's should, gonna make sense. Yeah, I should be on some more, but we'll we'll see on it. We'll see, we'll see. Yeah. But I should be on a lot of good things this but year. Good the, within the headline show is the headline there, show. Is the that's that's the next thing, man. Yeah, Sick. April fifth. Yeah. So you you tweeted Sir Spyro mm-hmm. about working together. Yeah, Spyro. Anything materialized there? Because nah, that guy's nah, a nah, monster. Nah. With he's the on, he's, his beats are crazy, but I just haven't I haven't even reached out like that. Yeah. He's he's always he's giving me the green light like yo when you when you're ready. Yeah. But I just haven't had the time to like pattern that yet. But definitely hopefully, good. Like, he's a monster still. He's definitely a monster. Zimbabwe girls are so pretty. I don't even know. This is from a while back. This this uh, uh, I got these a while back. So, the so that must have got all the Zim girls uh, up me in your mad. DMs. Do you know? Do you know what it is? Yeah, like the car. I'm not gonna lie. Zimbabwe girls are mad pretty. Like, a lot of them are pretty. I know a lot of Zimbabwe Zimbabwe girls as friends, innit? Yeah. And they're also pretty and and got got good figures, innit? I can't remember what inspired me to say that tweet. <laughs> but or who? Yeah, who? or who? Or who? Or who? Than the what? But I said a tweet and it's like. The T.O. was getting mad that like, all this, all these Zimbabwe girls just rolls up like, yo, it's about time you got noticed. But I'm thinking, is it that deep? Like, I just thought I was just saying, no, nah, yeah, like, whatever in it. Yeah. But it's like I was getting so much quotes and like it's like right, it's like it's, it's like maybe Zimbabwe girls go through a thing of like, a lot of other people don't like them. Well, I don't know, but the, the way they was reacting was like, see, like look, was, even he said kind of kind of thing. I'm thinking, right, like. I thought everyone knew this already, like, but it was yeah, mad, didn't yeah, it? It was yeah. mad. I gassed, I gassed them up. I, I, gassed, I gassed them up. <laughs> and the DMs were like, ping, ping, ping. Do you know what, yeah? <laughs> so that is a zoom no, you know, the only, every the, city. No, yeah, the, only, so. the only people that could DM these people I follow still. <laughs> So I won't get the DMs. I won't get the DMs. I won't get the DMs. Oh, okay, yeah, right. Yeah, just, yeah, just, yeah. The, just, just the, the mentions. Just the, yeah, just the mentions. And there's definitely must have been some DMs since, though. I know uh, you hit no, that follow no, back. No, no comment. What's, no comment. What's, <laughs> 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 I don't want to instigate. Uh, what's the most important thing you reckon you've learned since, I'd say, like in the last eighteen months, when you've really been mm. like out there as an artist? The most important thing I've learned. learned. Um. I don't know how to answer that question, man. The most important thing I've learned, probably like, well, I've learned that the industry is kind of fake, to be honest. Mm, yeah, kind like, of fake. Okay, well, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not trying to be, I'm not trying, I'm not trying to blacklist myself in it, but yeah. No, it's like, <coughs> you just got to know that like, it's not, it's by understanding it. I can't understand the game. I, I think I've just learned the game a bit. Right. I've learned the game. I've learned like, the politics and I've how to play. I've the politics and how to play it kind of yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's what it is. That's what I'll there's, say. There's a lot of superficialness. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly it, man. But I've learned. But I, I can't understand why the game is like that. Yeah. And no one really owes you anything kind of thing. It's like, you just got to play the game and just mm. do your thing, yeah. What else are you planning for this year? Because I feel I better, like... I better get me a mobile. Or at a least, mobile, yeah? Is that... At least, at least be a nominee. See, last year I was on, I was on a long list. Mm-hmm. I didn't make the short list. But I'm hoping, 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 hoping this year... Into the I, I've got like with the work I'm putting out and the stuff's gonna drop. Hopefully, I'll be even bigger than that. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Mm-hmm. But yeah, man. Because you just missed out on a rated award as well last year. Yeah, well, yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. I was there, but I didn't get it. I didn't get it. I didn't get. I didn't win. But I was just happy to be there, man. Like, yeah. yeah. I'm looking forward to the EP, bro. Yeah, man. It's coming in March. Which yeah, ain't that yeah, far yeah, away. Yeah, yeah, You've yeah, said yeah, it yeah. now. You've said it. It's out yeah, there. I'm gonna go put, it I'm is dropping before the headline show. Let's get it, Let's get it, man. Been a pleasure, bro. Thanks for passing through. I love having me, man. DJ Double with Big Topes. No, man, stack.